today we're going to be opening the most expensive mystery box on my store. This box has $289 worth of value in it. Here's everything in it. So we're going to go through these one by one. Let's start with the bills because I don't need a microscope to look at the bills. We first got a silver certificate. And then we have a lot of bills in here. So we're going to take these out and go through them. We have a $2 bill, a low serial number $1 bill. This one is three sixes in a row. I think that I put this in there as a fancier serial number. And then these two are sequential $1 bills. Then we got a fancy serial number $20 bill. A red seal $2 bill. A $1 star note from 2017. An older $5 bill. A $100 bill. That's right, you'll get a $100 bill in this mystery box. And an older $10 bill. This is a coin from the 1800s. And it's a foreign coin from the 1800s. It's from 1868. Let's see what's in here. In here we got a 1995 half dollar. A 1999. A 1997. In 1971. This is a coin from the 1800s. And this box has a half dime from 1872. This is a US coin. A lot of people don't know that, that the US actually made two cent coins, three cent coins, 20 cent coins, and half dimes. This half dimes were made before nickels were made. Let's see what's in here. That rip, that's fun. We got a foreign coin from 2014. This is a free gift. We have a Queen Elizabeth five pence. And a 2016 coin. Let's go to some of this bigger stuff now. We got a Canadian mint set. And here's that. And it comes with this card that gives you a little bit of information about it. This is an NIFC. Now, some of these were not NIFCs, like some of these were from like 1999. But this one is an NIFC. It's a 2016 Philadelphia. Let's open up some of these envelopes. Oh, this is a reproduction. This is not that it, this is not the actual bill. This would have been thousands of dollars if it was. And then this other envelope we have a foreign bill. It's a $2 bill. Let's see what's in here. This one doesn't say anything on the front. All right, there's a couple coins in here. We got 1960 Philadelphia. A 2021 Denver. A 2004 Philadelphia, a 2004 Denver piece medal, and a 2016 Philadelphia. Then this is a complete set 
of the Westward Journey nickels from 2004 and 2005, the Bison, Ocean the View, Peace Metal, and the Lewis and Clock Boat. And we got a 1999 Susan B. Anthony dollar coin. A little bit rare being a 1999. Then in here, we have two Canadians, a Canadian nickel from 1964 and a Canadian penny from 2006. Now we got a lot of these flips. A 1996 San Francisco Proof. A 1955 Denver Wheat Penny. Another Wheat Penny. It's a 1954. Two quarters. Just about uncirculated. A 1918 wheat penny and a 1919 wheat penny. A 1941 wheat penny. A 1928 wheat penny. A 1972 half dollar. Let's just take this out now. We do have a couple of rolls. We have a roll of dimes. I would not be opening this because this would be a bank wrapped roll for the box. Then we have a 2021 Philadelphia half dollar. We have a 1934 wheat penny. And we have a V nickel from 1903. We got a 2021 Denver uncirculated nickel. And I know this one's uncirculated because I got five rolls from a bank for the bank battle series. And they were all the same year, all the same condition. Then we got a 1964 in really good condition, minted in Denver. Then we got a Philadelphia 2015 dime. A bicentennial quarter. An Eisenhower dollar. This is 1971. We have a 1947. I think that's a San Francisco. We have a bicentennial half dollar. Almost done with the box. A 1985 penny. Two 1974 Denver minted half dollars. We have an entire set of the 2022 coins. 2022 Denver dime. 2022 Denver penny. 2022 quarter. And 2022 Denver nickel. Every box has a coupon code for 15% off. I'm not going to show you the code of the video though. You have to purchase the box to see what the code is. And we have two rolls of pennies. One of these I think is a roll of wheat pennies. So I'll need to open those and show you that. And then we have this to open in just a second. Alright, in this roll of pennies... I'm not going to say every year, I'm just going to look through it quickly. There's some 2009s. twenty one Denver. So this is good if you're starting a penny book, 
1959, 2019. So this is good if you're starting a penny book, then you have a whole roll of pennies with random dates and conditions. Now we have this roll to open. This, I believe, is a roll of wheat pennies. Yep, that's a 1957 ender. So this is a roll of wheat pennies with a special ender. The ender is a 2009 Philadelphia. I'm going to go through this and sort it by 40s and 50s and let you know what I find. All right. These are all the coins from the 50s. It's a lot of 50s in that roll. These are all the coins from the 40s. And then we got all these from the 30s. We got 1936, 1934, a 1939 and a 1938 and I saved the best for last if I open this up and take this coin out in this mystery pack is an 1878 Morgan dollar in the box so I actually have a lot more of these boxes I am going to open another one Coming this October, I'm going to open another box to show you what could be in a different box. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll be back with another one very soon. Stay tuned for some very exciting videos, and possibly some expensive videos coming soon. Bye.